Welcome back to another fucking rant, man. Today, <clears throat> I'm not gonna lie, bro. This is just me ranting about my my bullshit job, and uh, let, let let's just let's fucking dive into it, right? So mine, f- mind my fucking dogs barking. F- just pretend they're not fucking here, okay? So now I work at this seasoning company, right? This seasoning warehouse, very big brand. I'm not gonna say their name because like. I don't know. I feel like if it came across them, they might try to sue me or fire me or some shit. So I'm not I'm going to I'm not going to say that part. Right. But now let's let's just get into this shit. And and why I don't understand why these grown ass adults act like bitches. I don't get it. I don't understand it, bro. All right. So, boom, I work at this company. Right. I've been working here for like, I don't know, six months. Some shit like that. Six, seven. I've been working here for a a nice little grip. Right. And, you know, when I first started off here, everything was cool, calm. Nobody bothered me. You know what I'm saying? They just let me come to work, clock in, do my thing. Leave me the fuck alone. Leave me alone, bro. Leave me alone. Right. I, 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 I get along with everybody. If you leave me the fuck alone, just leave me alone. You ask anybody. I don't really talk like that. Like this is my personality because like on here but like in public i don't i don't like talking to niggas you know what i'm saying like i just don't i just like to stay to myself do my thing because one i don't like fake conversation i don't like this small talk bullshit i don't care about that i'm not gonna do it and if i don't got nothing to say i'm not going to force conversation so like major like 97 98 of my day at work is genuinely me just being quiet i don't like to talk you know what i'm saying i just want to do my job go home right so with me with me knowing how I am, I assume that I'm not going to have no problems, right? I come to work. I do my thing. I go home. Leave me the fuck alone, my nigga, right? No, no. They always got to find a way to just fuck with you. It, 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 ah, so, so boom, right? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, uh, I'm a flashback goddamn to the first, to, to the first in- incident to where I knew these some fuck niggas, these some fuck niggas. So boom. Uh, I'm on the I'm on the line, right? Doing my thing or whatever. We got this other nigga named uh named Daryl. Daryl, right? Hypothet hypothetically speaking, let's just say I'm just gonna come up with a name. His name's Daryl, right? So we get in there, right? And uh they tell Daryl, go uh stack off the the bags to go on the thing, right? So they tell him to do that. He doesn't want to do it, right? He he throws up this fit. He's like, no, these are this is a grown man, right? I'm probably the youngest nigga there. But he's like 30, acting like a bitch, right? They tell him to go stack off. He just keeps wandering off, letting the uh, assembly line stack up with, with bags of product because he doesn't want to stack it off, right? So then, boom, they tell me to go fucking help him out and shit. I'm like, okay, cool. So I get over there. The nigga acts like he doesn't want to do no work. So I'm like, nigga, who do you think you're about to get over on? Because not fucking me. I will get sent home before I go. I do this shit and you just watch me stack off like like nigga. What? So I looked at the nigga. What? What are you going to do? Right. So, boom. Um, We go back and forth with the top nigga, the top, top nigga. Right. He's like the line's not running this and that. And I'm like, I'm just staring at the nigga like, why? Why are you calling me over here, bro? Because I've been doing what you told me to do this whole fucking time. Right. So he's like, uh, why is the line not running? I'm like, he walked off. What do you want me to do? Right. So then we go back. Right. We go back. I'm I'm sitting at the uh, I'm still doing my thing. I haven't left. Right. They uh, somebody at the towards the front of the assembly, like towards the, the front. Right. Like they, it's called feeling and sealing somebody that was sealing left. Right. So there's two people stacking off and there's only one person at the front feeling and sealing. So she asked, she asked me to come over there to help her. I say, okay, cool. I go help her. I, and I called it. I told her, I said, this, this, I said, he's about to go snitch and I'm going to get called out. Right. A few minutes go by. He calls me back at this point. I'm just like, I'm laughing. Cause I'm like, bro, this is, this is fucking stupid. This is dumb as fuck, bro. So then I go over there. I tell him. And this this is when I found out I said, oh, OK, so you one of these bitch ass niggas. You think you actually got some power to talk to niggas crazy? I said, oh, OK, so now I see how y'all niggas get down around here. Right. So I get up to buddy and I'm like uh, his whole demeanor is like, nigga, he's like, get over here, get over here. 
So I'm I, I'm looking at I turn my head like nigga, bro, who you talking to, bro? Like on oh, bro, I don't hell no, nah, you're not finna talk to me crazy, bro. I I kid you not. So I'm like I'm basically trying to explain to him like, hey, she asked me to go help him, but what did I say? But what did I say? I said, yo, 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 relax, bro. I said she told me to go help, but what did I say? I was like, okay, so you you would rather me? I I literally asked him. I said, so you would rather me just let her be by, by her, be by herself and stay down here for for two niggas on a pallet? Yeah, he said yes. I said, nigga, you are stupid. You are a bot. Real life. I just said, I said, okay, cool, 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 right? Then fucking we end up he ends up doing some other more shit right and then so we both get called out there he says since you can't work since y'all can't work uh work together it seems i'm sending both of you home i said i said for what i said why are you sending me home he said no no i try to explain myself he says no no i don't want to hear it i don't want to hear it i said i said um so at that point a flip switched like i cared for a quick second and then once you showed me that shit, i said oh, okay i i asked him i said I can go home right now. I said, right now? You sure? Right now. He said, uh, y'all go in my office. I said, you sure? I said, cause I'm telling you that, that, that shit, man, I'm out of here. I'm out of here, bro. So, um, he was like, go to the office or whatever. I'm like, okay, cool, cool. I go sit down, right? The other, this grown ass man, he comes in there sitting down, sits down, act like he's huffing and puffing. I'm just sitting like, nigga, I, nigga, I dare you to come do something to me, bro. I dare you. I dare you, bro. I'm just sitting there, bro, right? So then, boom, the buddy comes in, the the top nigga, the top niggas of special ops or something. One of the top, top dudes, though. Not no not no team lead. Top, top. You know what I'm saying? They got access to the white folks. Real life. Real shit, nigga. Um, he was like, so it seems like y'all can't work together, this and that. But then he starts breaking it down, right? So when he's breaking it down, all his shit is going towards this character, this hypothetical character called Daryl, right? So the whole time I'm thinking, all your shit is pointed at, you're talking to him, you're not even talking to me. I'm like, why am I here, bro? I've literally been doing my job all day. Why am I here? You told me to go help, I helped. I didn't move. So like, why am I here, bro? And then Daryl's Daryl was trying to lie on me, right? And I'm like, Nick, I'm like, I'm like, bro, you're lying, bro. You're lying. And then I will say this, the top dude, he was like, um, everybody on your line, has said this at X, Y, Z, right? And I'm like, exactly. So what the fuck? What the fuck? Why am I here? Literally, right? So they end up uh, telling me, oh, you can go back to work. You can go back to work. I'm like, nigga, what? no, I want to go home now. You don't got me. You don't got me riled up. I'm ready to go home. Let me go home. Let me out. But, you know, I end up going back to work like a good boy. You know what I'm saying? And then from there, from that day, I just couldn't fuck with them niggas bro I, I i couldn't bro because i i see you i say oh yeah you flaw bro you flaw as fuck my nigga like i don't understand that shit bro like one you you talking crazy to me that's one thing that i i will never never let no man woman nothing talk to me crazy i say this i say man and this this is no shade to my dad or nothing i say i don't even let my dad talk like if he starts talking too crazy i, I like i'm like why i just look at him like no and then so i'm going and i got the and I respect that nigga the, the most out of anybody in this world on oh, God. And I don't, I don't even let him do it. I say, why are you, I say, why are you yelling at me? What are you yelling for on real life? So, and then I'm going to let this, you random grown man talk to me crazy. Cause you got a title. Nigga, stop the fuck out of you, nigga on man. When I tell you, bro, I can't wait till I can leave this job, bro. I'm going to pop my shit to these niggas, bro. I'm telling you these old and then they're they're pervy they're pervy ass niggas bro like they uh, they be wanting to touch on these on these like females and shit like that you know what i'm saying i just say man you niggas are weird bro y'all are weird bro and i just sit back and observe all this shit right and this is just a rant i ain't even gonna lie because I, I, I it's just a rant like it's just a rant like let's say like Cause, um, let's say I'm talking to a shorty up there, right? I just, I'm just talking, having normal conversation. I'm not trying to get at them. I'm not trying to get in their pants. I'm, I'm just talking, right? But they see a young nigga, obviously. And when I first got there, there was buzz around me. No, no, no cocky shit. Genuinely, there was a buzz. Like, who is that? Who is that nigga? Right? So all the eyes are on me and shit, right? 
So now all these old fucks see this shit going on. I guess they're jealous or something. So like I be I can be talking to just talking, just having normal conversation, right? The nigga come up and either ask me, start talking to me about some bullshit. No, no, no. Usually they don't talk to me because I don't want to talk to you niggas. They go talk to whoever the girl that I'm talking to or whatever. And like me, I don't I'm not phased by it. I'm just going to walk away like she's going to come talk to me later, bro. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I just don't be I just don't be understanding like and these are grown men, bro. 30, 40, 50 acting like this, bro. Like I'm like, nigga, what? What? Like, ah, I, I. So boom, back on the topic of these fucking um of these damn the, the 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 top dudes, right? So my beef with Buddy is that one, I don't know. How, it's just it's a disconnect between us, like how they how they move, how how they look at you when they talk to you. I'm just like nigga, I'm you. We both human regardless of whatever fuck position you got my nigga i don't give a fuck real life i don't care and these niggas they don't seem to get that and they think they can just like bully a nigga or they can intimidate me and i look dead at these niggas bro like what what's up man what's good like it, there was an incident right where i did something and i was in the wrong i'm not gonna lie i was in the wrong i'm not gonna say what i did but i was in the wrong like i should have handled it differently right um so then i end up basically i'm in the break room and like I've been gone for a minute, right? I, I I've been gone for a minute, uh, cause I couldn't find my I couldn't find my manager, so I just went and sat in the break room. I went I, I looked all around for my manager, couldn't find no team leads. So I'm like, y'all want me to do your job for you? I'm looking for y'all so y'all can tell me what to do. And there's nobody to be found. Okay, I just went and sat down in the break room. Oh God. So then one of the team leads comes in. It was like, hey Mike, you on break? I said no. And he was like, then he proceeds to say, oh, he said, oh Derek need to see you, man. I said. I wish y'all could see the face that I made and like how the nigga said that shit, bro. It was so cocky and arrogant, boy. I was like, I said, okay, cool, great. So then I go outside. Derek's talking to one of the females that I know. That has nothing to do with the story, but you know, it's just talking. So then they get done. He asks me, like, so where have you been, blase, blase? And I'm basically like, I straight up tell him, I've been in the break room. I was online. I said, I was online one. For a little bit and i went to, i couldn't find said i couldn't find nobody so i went to the break room right he said so and you thought that what he said you, and you thought that was okay i said no but it's what happened right and then he proceeds to ask me the same question in like three different ways and i said bro i said bruh i said i've been in the break room bro i said and i'm telling you that i didn't like i didn't go do i didn't do anything i didn't do any work for the time being, I said, I was in the break room and I'm telling you that. So like, why you keep you doing all this extra shit, man? I say, for what? I don't get it. I don't understand that shit, bro. I just, man, ah, right. And then, so he was like, you know, you know, I'm the one that, um, that has to do your review and all this for your raise and all that. I said, yeah, great. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, this shit fucking, oh, I want to say the company name so bad, but I feel like my luck, this video would just blow up. And then it'll it'll be on their doorstep and then I'm going to get fired. So, you know what I'm saying? That's why I said, I'm not going to say the name of the company, but yeah, I'm just like, bro, working with these old fucks, bro. It's just like, I I thought, I thought me personally, bro, when you go into, I thought when I was going to work with older folks, it's going to be chill. They're going to be mature. These is some whole ass niggas on my soul. Every one of them, man. Nah, it's one manager. It's one dude in there. And uh, he be on line one. I respect that nigga, bro. He he cool as hell. You know what I'm saying? He stay out the way. He just he just he just like me. It seemed that's that's what I take from buddy. He just like me. He just trying to go there, do his little shit, get a check, go home. He he ain't doing too much, right? You know what I'm saying? So I can respect that. But these this mm, other two three niggas on my shift, man, y'all niggas can suck my dick, nigga. Oh God, bro. I want to tell you, bro. Cause it's like, cause it's like, I see through that shit, bro. Like y'all, y'all are some lame ass niggas, bro. Y'all some lame niggas. And y'all think y'all, y'all something air quotations. Y'all think y'all something nigga. Cause y'all, y'all got this fucking, y'all got this title at this, this fucking company. But nigga, when you leave and retire or you get another job, nigga, these niggas don't care about you, bro. Y'all think these white folks really love y'all, bro. I, bro, as soon as you leave, bro, they, they are, before you leave, they got your replacement coming, nigga. 
and you think you're some big shit. I said, man, fuck you niggas, bro. Like even like, uh, oh, and then now the niggas, these niggas lying on me now and shit. I'm like, damn, I got niggas snitching on me, bro. I said, y'all are grown. I don't even mess with y'all, bro. Like I talked to like maybe three, four niggas at my job, bro. Real, I like, I, you know what I'm saying? Whole conversation. Maybe, maybe, bro. But even the people that I talk to at my job, I don't really talk that much, but it's like certain folks. I say, yo, what's good other than that? But like having conversation and it's not even like, <clears throat> oh, I think I'm better than them or anything. Nothing crazy. It's just, <clears throat> I don't be having nothing to say. If I don't got nothing to say, I'm not talking. You feel me? But like these niggas want you to be all buddy, buddy, key, 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 and ha 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 You're your funny nigga. Ain't shit funny, man. Ain't shit funny, man. Like the fuck. They let certain niggas. They'll they'll. This how they work, right? The 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 top dogs, right? The niggas that suck the that that meat ride them, laugh, be all jokey, jokey, buddy, buddy. They let these niggas take all types of breaks. Don't do nothing. But me. I take a 40 minute break when every when I say everybody takes 40 minute breaks, even though even though we're supposed to take 30 minute breaks. It's an unwritten rule. It's an unwritten rule at the job. You leave 10 minutes before and you come back at the appropriate time. So then you get 40 minutes. Right. And then y'all niggas going to snitch on me. Word. When I don't even mess with nobody. I don't even bro. I don't even mess with nobody, bro real life like i just come to work do my shit i be in my own little lane bro i ain't messing with nobody i don't get in no drama i don't want to know i don't know nothing bro and y'all niggas want to fuck with me i said huh, that's a bet and they over they said i don't know how to do x they said i don't know how to feel and seal xyz i said how i said how do i not know how to feel and seal when i done fucking I done ran this whole line when y'all niggas disappear. But y'all saying that I don't know how to feel and seal. Really? Hmm. Wow. But you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even get upset. I didn't get mad. I didn't say, who said it? Nothing. I just say, now I know y'all are, j- y'all are all bitch ass niggas. Now I don't trust none of y'all. Now, now my circle has gotten even smaller because I had somebody else come up to me and be like, your line is the one that told on you. I said, word. Okay. Okay. Cool. So now it's like, now, now I got to push them niggas down the level it's like nigga i can't even have real conversation with you no more because y'all really some slimy ass niggas you know what i'm saying and it's like i don't what are you snitching for though why are you snitching you know what i'm saying like why i've never i've and y'all are grown like i'm 20 these these niggas are 25 26 27 25 to like 50 50 plus right and y'all niggas is fucking with me for what because I'm not in y'all little clique. I don't want to be y'all friend. I don't care to know what's going on at the, I don't care. Like I'm telling when I come into work in the morning, hoodie on AirPods in chilling, go to the, like, I don't, I don't got shit to say to y'all niggas, bro. I'm here for a check, bro. And I, I, bro, bro, I can't stand these niggas, bro, here, bro. I swear to God, bro. I swear to God, bro, I'm trying to get out of there, bro. I'm trying my hardest to get out of there, man. They're, but they, they're trying to find, they're, you know how like they're, they're trying to find shit to get me out of there, but I'm not giving it to them. I'm just not giving it to them because I'm just smarter than them niggas. You know what I'm saying? These niggas want to work here 30, 40 years thinking they, I'm no offense to anybody, but working at this company, this particular company, 30, 40 years, nigga fucking dog shit, dog shit, thinking y'all are some big shit. I said, y'all niggas are fucking trash, bro. I'm telling you, bro. That's one thing, bro. I don't like that shit when when niggas, one, when niggas talk crazy and you think you can talk crazy and you arrogant because you got some power, nigga. In these, in the real world, you are a bitch. You got no pussy. You got no butt. If you have a wife, she's fat and ugly. You're fat and ugly. Like, I just, I just don't be understanding. I'm like, bro. You think you really think you 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 like that because of you got this title, my nigga in the streets. I'll fuck your wife. Real life. Your wife. See me. Your wife. See me in the streets. I'm turning heads. I'm turning her head. I'm telling you, I, I want to say that to that nigga, too, bro. I want to say it to him so bad. And I hope he I hope he charges me, my nigga, because I'm going to beat that nigga ass all my life. I'm going to beat that nigga ass, bro. I'm telling you, I just got to wait. I got to wait till I can pop my shit. I got to wait. 
But right now I'm playing the good. I'm playing the goods. I'm playing a good boy. I'm being a good boy. But I'm telling you, once I can pop my shit, bro, you a bitch ass nigga. You a bitch ass nigga. Suck my dick. I dare you to say anything to me, my nigga, because I'm going to slap the shit out of you, bro. On God, I'm going to slap the dog shit out you, bro. I'm telling you, bro. I hate, bro. Real life, bro. I really do like this. I don't like these niggas, bro. You know what I'm saying? But the folks that I do fuck with at my job, you know what I'm saying? Like the, the few, you know what I'm saying? Um, My girl, Kai. My girl, Kai. My girl, Sonya. I don't know. Sonya a little iffy. Sonya. Goddamn. What? Fifi. I got some new dudes that like, I don't, no, nah, no, nah, I won't count them. Cause I don't, I don't hold conversation. <clears throat> I really only talk to like, God damn. I would say another name, but like she on my line. So I can't trust her now. Cause, cause I was told she, they was snitching on me. So shit, the fuck, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not, I'm not going to say, Hey, did you snitch? I don't care. Yeah, I was told, I was told the whole line snitched on me. So fuck all y'all. You know what I'm saying? Nicole, you, maybe, maybe, but you know what I'm saying? I, so I really only talk to like two, three niggas at the job. You feel me? Well, you got my boy, maybe three, four. You know what I'm saying? That I actually talk to now because niggas are hoes. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, man. I like this, man. This felt good to get off my chest, man. I, I really, I, that felt great. I don't, I'm not even going to lie to you, bro. This bit's 20 minutes, 21 minutes. I don't even expect y'all niggas to get through this whole video, but this was just for me, for me. Because like, I, I really needed to get that off my chest, bro. Because when I tell you, bro, niggas have been pissing me off like every fucking day man now we can't leave the floor can't leave the floor till 2 30 for what we get off at 2 30 and say say from 2 15 to 2 30 you got to clean up great so now niggas is just bullshitting from 2 15 to 2 30 until 2 30 <clears throat> so it's like what are you like it's it, it. <sighs> man 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 fuck man got i why, why, why am i letting these niggas stress me out man what's what's going on man i forget i forget the, these niggas are working here for to survive i'm working here just as a stepping stone so i i gotta <clears throat> I, I be trying not to let shit phase me but like but when it comes to like bitch ass niggas though and that fuck shit i i get pissed because i say man in the real world you are not like this like you think you somebody in these con in the confinement of these walls, just like prison guards, COs, they think they somebody because you got a gun and a badge or something. No, no. These y'all think y'all somebody because y'all got a fucking title. These fucking white folks don't give a damn about you, my nigga. Oh, but you think you could. Nice. I'm telling you, I can't wait. I can't wait till I can pop my shit because I'm telling you I want that big nigga to do something to me so I can fuck him up man I can't even say what I'm gonna do to the nigga but trust I'm telling you I'm gonna hit him with this line right here bro when the last time you fucked your wife fuck nigga when hmm do you or you don't have a wife fat fuck you trash son of a bitch now what now what now do something I was oh so you so you do got a wife oh, okay oh, okay she don't fuck you though Okay, cause look at you, fucking bum, bum ass nigga, and I'll fuck your wife. Well, now what? Now what? In the real world, in the real world, I can fuck your wife, bitch ass nigga. Now what? And I didn't. I I'm, I'm hoping that right there is gonna get him to charge out of the seat. And and oh man, I'm telling you, man. Oof, real life, real life, man. Uh, now I see why niggas crash out, bro. I see, I see why niggas crash out, bro. I understand, real life. Cause if I had nothing to live for, I would go not crash out, like go kill the nigga, but like, just go pop my shit immediately. You know what I'm saying? But I see the bigger picture. I need the job right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm in the process of like getting some more shit, but like, yeah, you know what I mean? But yeah, this was a long, long ass video. You know what I'm saying? I don't expect y'all niggas. If bro, I ain't gonna lie. If you got to the end of this video, bro, I want you to comment down below cheese balls, cheese balls. I don't care how you spell it. Just cheese balls, cheese balls. I'm telling you, like, cause I don't expect, I, I genuinely don't expect nobody to get through this shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Cause I know y'all attention spans, everybody attention spans is kind of like low and shit. So I, I get it. But like I said, this was for me. I just wanted to, I just wanted to rant and I'm just going to put it out. You know what I'm saying? Because why not? Why not? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, man, if you made it to the end of the video though, bro, 
like I said, comment down below, cheese balls. And I know you a real nigga because I know you really be watching all the videos. You know what I'm saying? I know you be watching for real, for real. So, yeah, man, if y'all enjoyed this, man, like the video. Subscribe to your boy. I got more of these rents coming because I be getting pissed all the time, man. I got more. I got more coming. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Yeah, I be li I'm live on Twitch. I got to get I got to remember my announcements. I stream. I am streaming on Twitch um now instead of youtube it is mike g underscore gaming the links will be in the description also follow my instagram i don't be posting but i'm gonna become one of these fashion niggas real soon just give me time follow my instagram follow my snapchat mm, just follow my snapchat just because type shit you feel me um what else are we forgetting scratch 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 my head mm, i think that's it i think that's it man uh i will see y'all boys in the next video bro take care Bye bye Tata goodbye